up? This is Kelvin from Wizard Tricks. So I got another video for you guys tonight. It's late. I'm like right by the In-N-Out parking lot. I hadn't filmed the video yet today and I was like, I gotta do it for you guys. There is an update that I wanna tell you guys about, so I'm gonna jump into that. But I just, I had to get out here and do a video for you guys because uh, I haven't really been able to play with United at all. It is Friday. I don't know what time it's gonna be when this video actually gets uploaded. So if it's in the middle of the week, hope you're having a good week. But it's Friday right now, and man, has it been a full week for me. But I had to get a little bit of Wizards Unite in before the day was done. I literally have like 15 minutes left in the day. Uh, so, so I'm definitely just sliding this one in. Um, but there is a really good update, and it's something that um, They've added, they've actually added a lot of stuff um, to the game. I, th they did like a little minor update that they mentioned, but there's been a much larger update um, in some of the stuff that they've done, both uh, with the game, and I'll show you a little bit of that um, right now, but also some pretty useful features they've added, which is, in my opinion, a pretty big deal, really helpful um, to the game. So let me show you what that is right now. Let's, let's go into a foundable and check it out. So when you click into a foundable, there's a couple things that are different. The biggest thing is that you can see the fragments at the top. So right where the green, uh, the green is right at the top there for how good your spell is, um, there is a fragment and then it has a fraction basically of how many fragments you've returned versus how many you, um, you need to complete that. And as you can see here, this one in particular is four of four. Uh, which is which is what you need uh, so that is good for me on that one But this is gonna be really nice so you can actually keep track of what your foundables are that you need uh, So I think this is overall really useful um, So that you have an idea of if you have this or not Maybe should you use a potion things of that nature um, are definitely important and then uh, it's also nice, they've added some stuff into this too, telling you how many dark detectors you have, which I think is really actually beneficial. Uh, I don't think they had that just like in this main frame uh, before. This is definitely, definitely different. And if I'm crazy, I may just be completely crazy. Um, but there's also a couple other things that I'm gonna show you once we're in a foundable as well. So I'm gonna go find another one and show you some of the other updates with Wizards Unite. Oh. Never mind, they are literally right here. It's just like I like wanted one and they showed up. Uh, so, gonna jump into another one. And as you can see, one of the other things you can also see, you know, this is 10 of 10, which is great, but you can also see up in the left hand corner, there is a running, uh, a running like away, but it has a circle. It used to be like there, but this is much more noticeable and I think a little bit easier to press. It's not quite as difficult. And you exit right away, which is really nice. So I think hunting foundables and trying to complete your registry, this is so much more helpful um, it's because you can really get out of things really quickly if you want so you can just check you can just like because you know with like Pokemon for instance you can just like see what it is on here but you have to enter into the uh, to the foundable to actually know what type of foundable it is within that family uh, which is kind of a pain in the butt if you're really trying to do your um, really complete your registry so just being able to jump in here and then quickly press out without a warning or an asking or anything like that is really nice I think that's a great feature and it's just uh, not like that important but I think it just adds a little bit of ease to the game so I think it's a really awesome update there are some other stuff um, that they did update within the game uh, and I went over some of those in another video which I'll put up and there's a lot more within this major update that they've just released so I'm sure over the coming days I'll do a couple more videos on some of the stuff that they have packed in this brand new update uh, for Wizards Unite so there you go that's a little bit of Wizards Unite for for the night I'm um, gonna get some rest and I'm actually going to Disney tomorrow so that should be awesome really looking forward to that so I'll have like a Disney video up in fact that video may get prioritized above this one I may put the Disney one up before I even put this update one up so we'll see how that ends up playing out in terms of my upload schedule with YouTube but again thanks for watching if you like that if you got something out of it definitely smash that like button I appreciate you guys watching of course subscribe to the channel it really helps a lot and I will see you guys at Disney if you guys are there I'm gonna post on Twitter definitely hit me up uh, should be a lot of fun if anyone is playing Wizards Unite inside of um, 
inside of Disney, we should definitely do like a fortress at the castle or something like that. That'd be awesome. Hopefully that actually happens. I w that would be, that would like make my day. So hopefully that happens. But anyways, thanks for watching guys and I'll see you guys later. Bye.